chain link price prediction and technical analysis for 2019 welcome back guys it's crypto rocker from rockstar trading channel guys and today i'll be doing a technical analysis and review of chain link guys so i'll be giving you guys an update on chain link so what's been going on since the crazy news of google cloud integrating chain link oracles and then guys i'll be giving you guys my thoughts on chain link guys um, and then at the end of the video i'll do what i do best i'll do my price prediction and thoughts on where the price could be heading for chain chain link guys so first of all i'd like to say i've made details videos on chain link guys before everyone started talking about chain link i made a video on chain link on four or five months ago let me find out exactly when i made it that was a while back um so if you want more details that was six months ago guys imagine if you bought that when i made that video and um, i did i didn't buy exactly then and i sold a lot uh, before it started pumping but that was a good video to make so make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button for videos like that even chain link videos recently guys i talked about you know this pullback and um, i was expecting a bit more follow through but again that was a nice little i think 10 percent trade and i called it before it happened as well again i'm not saying i get all my calls right but chain link predictions has been great so make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button for more updates so guys since chain link had made that google uh, partnership guys chain link price went crazy guys if you look at when the news came out on the 14th of june the news came out and the price i think i'm sure that that will be 14th of june the big green candle it is 14th of june and since then guys if you see it went up 143 percent and it would have been a really crazy profit but when something goes parabolic guys it always pulls back a uh, technical na analysis i've seen it ha happen thousands of time on penny stocks and hundreds and thousands of types on altcoins guys it keeps happening so so it's very risky to buy over here guys and it's pulled back it had a bounce and it's consolidating over here so coin also coinbase pro announced support for Chainlink. those two news were really positive and it really helped chain link price go through so in overall just take brief again i recommend you watch my older videos to find out more thoughts on chain link fundamentally i'll quickly give you an overview on what my thoughts are on chain link and so chain link guys is connecting smart contracts to the inputs and outputs it needs guys and there are issues with smart contracts which can't access data on their own so guys what chainlink is trying to do is you know this you know when there's a centralized single point of failure guys it doesn't perform as well when it goes through a single node guys it creates the same problem which smart contracts themselves seek to avoid single point of failure with single oracle node your smart contract is only as re reliable as that one node the solution is highly reliable decentralized oracle network chain links oracle network provides the same security guarantees as smart contracts themselves by allowing multiple chain links to evaluate the same data before it triggers so that eliminates a single point of failure if you're invested heavily in chain link again i'm more of a trader guys i depend more on price action but i did do like chain link project uh, but chain link long-term project is not going to be affected by the short-term price if you're looking for short-term price increases then you know the pro the importance of project is probably not going to help it's more about news and emotions that affect you one thing i did like it was the token usage of link in the whole ecosystem i found that quite interesting i'd highly recommend you do read this bit up guys if you're interested in chain link fundamentally a lot of it i probably need to read again because i did scheme through it and i'm not a coder or a cryptographer or an expert in blockchain but i, I, I do love blockchain and i've been reading up about different projects and white paper if you're investing in any project guys you need to read the white paper and if you're, if you're interested in cryptocurrency hopefully you have read the bitcoin white paper so one thing i'm really interested going forward for Chainlink is the oracle partnering with Chainlink guys to help startups sell their data this could actually be a positive and i'd say an adoption for for crypto uh, cryptocurrency and we don't really see it happening so we are going to co-develop chain links with 50 qualified startups to prepare themselves them to sell their data to oracle 430 customers in 170 countries on oracle blockchain platform the startups are going to be announced in oracle code one in september and that date i believe is the 30th of september guys and that is a big news for chain link i'm not sure if it 
if it will be affected by the price because maybe a lot of just normal investors that you know just buy and sell because of news won't be looking at it guys but if, if that news gets you know shown on twitter reddit then again reddit is a great place to find out about news i i do do it sometimes to validate my thinking my main thing is price if i see price action i mean i've seen i, I stare at charts you know 20 hours a day sometimes and i know i see patterns all the time and and when i see a pattern and i see a news uh, fundamental news validating it i love that trade but usually guys are more of a technical analysis trader but that could be a positive for chain link especially this you know the partnering the, the uh, p using oracle you know the 50 qualified startups with which they co-develop link to prepare the startup to sell their data i think that is a very good adoption news and you know more people using chain link and cryptocurrency is a good for the whole cryptocurrency market so that's just a quick update what i'm looking at for chain link guys i will keep you guys up to date with any new news that are coming out uh, with chain link so make sure you subscribe to my channel for more updates but that is my thoughts on chain link guys from a fundamental point of view i'm going to go into a technical analysis now i do provide technical analysis for free guys every day uh, on our facebook group twitter uh, telegram everywhere you can find all the links below guys and again ren was a great call chain link was probably one of my best calls and it was a really nice trade so make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification buttons for updates like that guys um, and also it's completely free free to join guys i'm interested in creating an educational group um, if you're interested in joining that you can email me at cryptorocco at hotmail.com it will be probably the first 10 or 20 people that want to join i'll probably charge nine dollars and then you know the next 20 or 30 20 dollars uh, so yeah so if you're interested in joining for the early birds and people that really enjoy my content i'd i'd love to work with you guys so you send me an email at cryptorocco at hotmail.com if you are interested so guys let's do a technical analysis um Chainlink guys, I was really hoping that Chainlink hold that green level guys. This is a level that I talked about about a month ago in my um in in the youtube channel i made a video about it saying this needs to bounce from here and it had a really nice bounce it couldn't get above that red zone so that is a, a bearish signal that it couldn't get above the red zone but what it what is worrying me is if if it breaks below this green zone guys if it breaks below this green zone i mean if you look at this price structure guys what does this look similar to does this look similar to the bitcoin price structure guys uh, on the daily you know we, we had a very big structure where it broke down below kind of descending triangle structure does that look similar to that again i'm not saying it's going to crash like that but if when 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 people starts to lose hope on chain link people invest with qu quick short-term interest and when they do not get that quick short-term gain that they want they might leave this project and try and chase the next shinier thing and price can price can really drop if chain link sort of does this that was really bad drawing let me try that again apologies for my drawing if it tries to get above it fails and it breaks the low and makes a lower low guys then i wouldn't be interested in chain link guys i'll wait for it to get above the green zone if it gets above the green zone and does this then it will be really bullish for chain link so those are the two actions i'm looking at and it's at a key level guys again it, i mean i've already sold my chain link i've talked about exactly where i sold it i took a nice trade here i think i sold my previous stash here guys most of it i think i sold here i was really uh, disappointed that i did i didn't get the google pump because i think i sold it for a less, less profit but again you win some you lose some i'm more of a trader and i didn't catch as good as good of a gain as some of the other people did on the facebook group that i run there some really knowledgeable people in the facebook group if you want to join uh, crypto investors network.com uh, on facebook group so that is my thoughts on chain link guys this green zone is really really important and you need to keep an eye out for bitcoin as well i mean uh, uh, my previous updates on bitcoin was looking at the green zone for bitcoin and um, let me show you what i was talking about so this was the level i was talking about bitcoin tried to get above it failed tried to get above it again it failed and we saw a big sell-off and that is kind of my thoughts on bitcoin again guys um it may be finding some support here but it's still looking quite weak and if bitcoin does something crazy it will have a knock-on effect on Chainlink. so that's just my update on Chainlink, guys my price prediction on Chainlink. if Chainlink can you know hold this level and move up and bitcoin doesn't do anything crazy and maybe this news 
gets some positive you know people spreading rumors then guys then it could be really good for Chainlink but really really need to see people talking about Chainlink again on Twitter Google uh, people look at other coins and not Chainlink as much not sure what's happening to my trading view but I mean I've talked about what I wanted to talk about I've shared the main points I wanted to share with you so those are the two scenarios I'm looking at guys if Chainlink can get above this level guys with volume coming in you can see the volume literally dying off which is good to see guys but if we see a spike in red volume that will be bad if we see a spike in green volume that will be good guys but we really need to see chain link bouncing because if not the next zone I will be looking at is sort of the 2000 uh, level zone and I'll also do a quick before I go, I'll do a, a price on Link Dollar because people, a lot of people, actually look at Link Bitcoin. I I trade of Link Bitcoin and not as much on Link Dollar, but I know a few people that actually trade on Link USD Dollar. So I'm gonna do a quick price prediction on Link Dollar as well before I go. This is really disappointing that my YouTube, uh, my trading view is not working. I'll give it a couple of minutes guys if it's not working I'll have to make another video uh, but this video has been a really good video I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed it guys you know what to do guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel guys and I'll be making lots more videos for you so make sure you subscribe to my channel so the the USD video guys if you're interested in the USD video when it hit this this level again if you hadn't sold at the top when it broke down of this consolidation I've made a post about it it was very bearish now it's below the moving average guys hopefully it can find a bounce from here guys but if it doesn't guys it could be going to less than one dollar or one dollar level you can see the 786 level it's trying to bounce off the 618 level it also bounced off the 50% level if I may if I'm not wrong let me just double check you can see it bounced from 50%, bounced on 618. If it can't hold above 618, surely it will uh, test the 786 level. So this is this is a couple of zones I'm looking at for link dollar levels. So hopefully, if you're hodling, guys, keep an eye out for those levels. So thank you very much for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this price prediction video. If you have enjoyed it, guys, I'd, I'd, I'd hopefully expect you to comment below your thoughts on Chainlink. Do you think Chainlink is going to go up? Do you think it's going to break higher into, you know, $6, $10, some crazy people are saying? Or do you think Chainlink is not going to be a great project as other people are saying? My thoughts, like I said, I like fun I like Chainlink fundamentally, but price action wise, if there's not news and buying coming in, in the short term at least, the price might not see those crazy moves that we are expecting. Ask yourself whether you're a long term investor or whether you're a short term investor and stick to your strategy with proper risk management don't go crazy don't invest everything you've got invest what you can afford to lose I always preach this and in the educational group that I'm creating will be which will be you know cheap for the people that are joining initially you know just 999 I think that's what I'm gonna charge so email below for all those cheap prices I'll try to launch in the next couple of weeks to a month so if you're interested email me at cryptorock at hotmail.com for early bird access so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another the great video go chain link go